Hey, hi, hello, welcome back to my new video. This is Sampath. You're watching Sampath Surfax YouTube channel, and this is Poco F3 or the Xiaomi Mi 11X 5G or the Redmi K40 custom ROM reviews. You can see here Android version is 13 and Mi 11X Aliot in C Android version 9.12. Yes, it's not an Android 14 build, it's an Android 13 build, latest one. You can see December 5th, 2023 is the security patch and Vendor security patch is also December 5th, 2023 baseband version. You can see kernel usage is 4.19.298 Alioth version 2. Kernel has been used. Build date is again December 13th. Latest one available for Mi 11X. This is typical home screen and quick settings panel you guys can see here. I am also running this Aqua battery application. You can see some of the results here. And starting with this quick settings panel you guys can see it's an Android 13 guys not an Android 14 smoothness in the UI is there you can see the some of the axis like Dolby Atmos is also pre-installed here let me drag that away yeah sync option other things you can see on the screen let me disable this location yeah you guys can see Dolby Atmos support is also there in this particular room in app active status you can see active batteries running into the background of this particular smartphone after flashing this say i tried based on android 13 guys now see some benchmark results before that i want to show camera application here you get basic thing but it will work fine as you can see all other things are working fine basic things like video you can record up to yeah 1080 60 fps sorry 4k 60 fps option is also given here this is a basic app but still you can do many of the things you can scan the documents and take photographs and videos in 4k 60 fps what i said before that's the camera application if you want something advanced you can use any z cam ports that's available for me level so the poco if there's a redmi k40 by the way if you first time to this channel hit that subscribe button down below guys and also all of the bell notification by pressing the bell icon and if you like the video give it a like starting with the dialer you guys can see this is the dialer we get it's not a google dialer you also get a direct video call feature and it will announce the other person that you are recording the no not that case here you get a different dialer here it's a shared rod dialer you guys can see here other settings you can see sound and vibration and display options phone number lock up calling action block numbers you can do these things other settings you can see here on the screen uh, hardware level of proximity sensor is going to fix here in this dialer uh, if I go into settings again okay as you can see disable proximity sensor because in the meme 11x we should not get proper proximity sensor available this dialer I really like it once you flash this from will come to know now DRAM information again level 1 certified no need to worry about that you will get high definition resolution in OTT platforms that's not a problem here even safety net status also get passed as you can see cts profile match and basic integrity both the things get passed here since you can use all the payment applications like google pay phone pay whatever you want to use those going to work fine here now some of the results like geekbench score you can see 1143 is the single score 3265 is the multi score and android version is 13 again linux 4.19.298 infin or alias version 2 kernel has been used that's good score and 100 test of cpu throttling test results you guys can see minimum is around 194 average is 234 and maximum is 256 and this is for 15 minutes guys and it throttled to 82 percent of its max performance and here are the anti to benchmark results 3.5 degree celsius is the temperature raise and five percentage of battery has been dropped and the score is 8 lakh 50 sorry 5145 if i can show you in the app you guys can see as you can see 8 like 5000 sorry 5145 this is the score what i got during this particular ROM gallery application again i want to show this as you can see charging rapidly is also supported in this particular ROM around 1243 it's 64 percent 1254 it's 90 the charging speeds are fast here on 5 pm again it's 99 percent that's the charging speeds and 33 watt charger support is there here you won't get any uh, yeah you will get dull backwards again with that you also get this audio effects and even me sound and answer is also given let me start with that as you can see sound and vibration again you get plenty of options here me sound and answer is given headphone type preset and select scene and hi-fi audio system all those things are given including with dull backwards these things have been 
included in this particular room not only that you also get this uh, ringtone vibration pattern you can customize them here and the battery again the battery life is quite good in this particular room i can't say it's a great battery life powered smartphone in mean, this particular room but anyhow you will get a good to very good battery life in this particular room since it's an android 13 you won't get any new uh, any new changes here but thermal profiles and other things you will get for individual app you can choose them out battery saver again extreme battery saver is not given but you can schedule and you can even turn off and charge more than 90 percent you can see battery optimization again individual apps you can select from here and display settings again it's quite similar here night light and dark theme you can adjust the intensity and schedule it out and pure black theme is also given you can see the screenshot previously what i showed the benchmark results that are taken in the dark theme colors again you can customize them uh, allow windows level burst tap to wake tap to sleep wake on plug those things are also given here for app refresh rate live display other things also you can customize from here accessibility again you get plenty of options here this is a handy feature you should definitely try it out security and privacy you get face and fingerprint unlock both are working fine no problem regarding that too gaming experience also going to be good here into the share dot settings you get plenty of customization you can see on the screen as you can see guys each and every customization is included here status bar followed by quick settings and followed by lock screen as you can see plenty of customization once you flash the ROM you will definitely go through it already explained in plenty of videos navigation and buttons customization even uh, user interface wise customizations are also given notifications again there are plenty and sound and again miscellaneous here you get unlock high fps in games like bgm and unlimited photo storage definitely it's going to be a gaming rom also once you flash the rom try to play uh, pubg new state it will be well optimized at least compared to uh, this one bgm but anyhow if you are in different countries you can try pubg mobile also that's a little bit better optimized compared to bgm it depends upon updates and updates once the previous update is not good then you should wait for newer update of rom or at least or the game these are the things you should keep in mind and into system into gestures again system navigation gesture navigation pill length and radius you can adjust i really like it if you want to go back to two button three button navigation button you can do that from here these are the customization and other things i hope I explained everything in detail regarding this particular room if you have any specific questions you can join the whatsapp group and you can also feel free to add the comments in this particular video itself i hope you like the video if you have still any questions again you can join groups and you can follow me in social media and you can ask the questions in the comment section directly i will reply them first watch the video then only you can come to understand more here that's all guys i'm shambhat signing off we'll meet you with another interesting video until that keeps smelling but for now